Yes, sir. I was going to show you my boat, and if you wanted to grab three items out of it, whatever three items you want, you can keep. And, uh, yeah. Let's, All right, let's do it, man. Yeah, let's do it. Welcome back to another... W welcome... Yo! What? I'm filming from a channel, bro. What the heck? What is he saying? What is he saying right now? Can anybody translate this? It just keeps going. It's like never ending. He's so good. Look at him. Okay, come on. It's enough. It's enough. They get it. They get it. They understand. I was kidding. Go, go, go. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of the Guggen Squad. Welcome back to another episode of the Guggen Squad. Baby! And today... Mi nombre es Alex Perico. Where, where did my friend go? <laughs> Hold on. We're, we're going to go into Guggen HQ. We're going to go into Guggen HQ. We're going to come say hi. I forgot your name. Clayton. Clayton. Yes, Clayton. sir. Would you, would you like to come back to Guggen HQ? I got, I got a little proposal for you. Hell yeah, man. Hell yeah. yeah. Come on back. Come on back. Yes, sir. So we like we like doing surprises here. We like yes, just sir. doing random stuff when we can when we're around the warehouse. I was gonna show you my boat, and if you wanted to grab three items out of it, whatever three items you want, you can keep. And uh, yeah, so let's. All right, let's do it. Man. Yeah, let's do it. So what kind of boat I'm rocking? I'm rocking a one. Yes, sir. It's, uh, it's an aluminum bass boat. It's powered by my Mercury. And uh, yeah, it's probably my favorite boat I've ever owned. I've gotten. This is my third boat. It's a bass boat, kind of a bass boat hybrid mix. And I just drove down here from Chicago three days ago. So it's got a lot of Chicago tackle, a lot of northern tackle in it, but there's some stuff in here. Clayton. Yeah. Clayton, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Where are you from? Uh, Decatur, just right down the road. Decatur, nice. Yes, sir. Jump in. Whatever you want. Seriously, take three items. A little surprise. Yeah, I started out watching some John B videos, and then I got turned on to the Guggen Squad. And yeah, it's been pretty great, man. I love y'all's y'all's content and everything. Are these the new yeah, Guggen you, rods? Yeah, man? check them out. What do you think? Oh man! Wow. Y'all put a lot of work into these, huh? I know y'all yeah. have been doing tons of tons of prototypes. Yeah, we didn't really want to rush the uh, rush the process with those. I could show you kind of a little something funny in here or something cool. Okay, so, <laughs> so I wanted to show the process kind of. This is yeah. one of the prototype rods. Okay, so this is like one of the earlier ones? Yep, yeah, one of the earlier ones. And I wanted to, so this is like the OG OG. This is the first one we ever made. And just to compare the difference between this rod and that rod. Okay. Just quality too and like the grips and stuff. Yeah. And then we went to this like kind of like shaped into that. Okay. Which is, that's still, that's not the final. Yo, I love the, uh, I love the, uh, the tape measure you got on there. Yeah, yeah, that it's a great sweet. idea. Here, I got him, I got this, I got this. <laughs> He's running away. <laughs> Oh my 
Uh, hey, don't mess up my video. Huh? Don't mess up my video. All right. I'll see you later. We'll see about that. Okay, we'll see about that. Is that who y'all did the uh, the Mexico series with? Yeah, Juan. Nice. Yeah, Juan's an nice. awesome guy. He's got a channel based out of Georgia. Does a bunch of fishing. Okay. So that's that. And then uh, I kind of went. Let's get back over here. It went to you know the final green series run. This is right here. Man, that is impressive. Yeah. Love the ruler on it. You had to beat that for sure. Wow. How much did these, uh, are y'all gonna re retail them for? I think they're gonna, I, I, don't quote me on this, I believe mm -hmm. this is 99. Okay. Either 99 or 129, and then the gold series is 149. Okay, that's pretty easy. Yeah, they're gonna be under 200 bucks. So when you said I can take anything, you mean yep. anything? Anything. <laughs> Does it, does it include a combo? Or do it, sure, or well that counts one, as one, one and that counts as okay, one. Okay, okay, I got you. And we, we, we've got uh, we've got other stuff too, you know, you gotta make sure you yeah, go yeah, through yeah. all Good the cabinets idea. and see what, Good whatever idea. you want, because we got baits on baits. Now I have been seeing some of these guys on y'all's channel. That's actually what I won against Juan Carlos yesterday, was I was catching him on the wow. Sakoshi bug. That's Sikoshi a bait made, bug. yeah, it's bait, bait made by Ketchco. Yeah. Great on like a Ned rig or any type of finesse rig. Three items. Any three items in the boat. You can find it, you can have it. We've got plastics and baits kind of in that compartment I mean, there. Yeah, it's somewhat yeah. like all your uh, all your s s swim baits are right there. Yeah. Then you got some other harder tackle in there. And then we got this side. This is kind of the what is even in oh, here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Man, y'all do it all. <laughs> got some fins and snorkel. Got some, got some leash dragons here. Oh, yeah, for your surfboards? Leash dragons. Just randomly in a rod locker. <laughs> you need a volleyball? <laughs> Brian! Masks. Just like, what is even in here? Oh my gosh, you even got your hummingbird in there? Yeah, hummingbird. Uh, unfortunately, I will have to say you can't take the hummingbird. Yeah, I don't want to take that off. I need the hands. hummingbird. Yeah, that's, that's a, got a hip for price tag. Live, live wells. Can I snag a battery? <laughs> <laughs> you can unhook it. No, I don't want to take that. Hmm. Let's see. Thinking I'm liking that uh, one of those combos up there. Yeah, I gotta love a baitcaster combo, especially if it's on a Guggen rod and it's a gold series too. Yeah. Yeah, that thing is. I think that was like the first or second thing I touched, so. He's going back to the rods. And it's on a DC. I haven't had a uh, metanium DC. He picks up my favorite combo right there. That is 100. <laughs> hey, hey, don't don't feel bad though. No, no, no. I'm just 100. percent that, look at the other one. That's too. what you want. You take it. That's a Shimano DC metanium reel. So it's like a super high quality digital chip reel, and then it's got the gold rod with the uh, the go to. So that's just like an all around jig rod, Texas rig. My favorite combo, right now. I have the. Uh, Corrado DC. But I don't have a. Yeah, that's a little oh different. yeah, that's kind of like this. That's ones. a little different. That's a Corrado 70. I think. Okay. So it's just like a smaller jig twitch reel. I use that for jerk baits, top water. Mm. What would you say your favorite type of fishing is? Uh, I do a lot of bass fishing around here. Um, the DFW area. Uh, love catching white bass and hybrids. We go to Ray Roberts a lot. Um, and then also go to Lake Texoma. We fished the uh, the Denison Dam for catfish and striper a lot, and then gotta love uh, fishing at the coast down in Port Aransas and Rockport. So. Nice. nice. Um, I think Bass is... fishing wise, do you like topwater jigs? Like... Ooh. Definitely can't can't go wrong with the topwater bite. There's nothing like seeing a seeing a big bass blow up on a top water but oh, yeah. uh, I think I'm probably uh, I've caught my biggest fish on a fluke believe it or not cool how big uh, I don't know exactly I didn't have a a scale or a tape but I'd say it was anywhere around nine to ten so this would be one two and three yeah hmm. or you could take that jig off all right yeah I think I'm gonna take the jig off and see what else you got Item one is a uh, Shimano DC Metanium reel, and item two is a Guggen Gold Go-To. Is that the Go-To? 
I believe so. Okay. Go to. Just, yep, go to. Guggen go to. My. F you can throw jigs on this. You can throw spinner baits, buzz baits. It's, it's, a, it's an all around very nice rod. It's a seven foot medium heavy. And just great rod. <laughs> there you go. go. Awesome. Oh. Are these the new bio spawns or are these the that's, uh, that's, the, the ten thousand fish? That's a ten thousand fish. Okay. Um, I forget what the name color. of it is called, but you can use this on the back of like a trailer as a chatterbait nice. trailer or even a fluke. Yoda worm. Yoda worm. Yoda worm. That's yeah. what it is. Yeah, I've seen y'all fishing with those a couple times. Sweet. I think I'm gonna go with the with the Yoda worms, man. Oh, I like the choice. I like the choice. Yes, All right. Thank you so much. No you problem. Have to do that. All right, you got your three baits. Now get the hell out of my boat. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> hey, thanks, man. Yeah, Appreciate no problem. It. Yeah, cherish that. Oh, You're probably God. one of the only people that has a Guggen rod right now. I am absolutely <laughs> going to cherish it. You have no idea. Well, Clayton. Yes, sir. Nice, nice to meet you. Thank you, man. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Yes, sir. Send me some pictures. Absolutely. It was cool seeing you. You just never know what's gonna happen. I was just got done filming some some meetings and we were doing podcasts and stuff like that. And I kind of just walked out here on a limb. Saw Clayton in there. We got to talking a little bit, and then Wes walked out. I'm like, why not? Come to my boat, take something. I'm, I'm gonna order another one of those reels probably. The only thing I'm on the fence with is a go-to gold rod is so hard to come by right now that I might have to wait until like January when they come back in stock. But that'll be all right. We got the green series and plenty of other baits in my boat. Nonetheless, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's episode of the Guggen Squad. My name's Alex, and we'll catch you guys on the next episode.